Hey everyone, thanks for joining me at my channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how I made a straight crochet wig using Superline Collection 100% Canical on Hair. Here's the video and I will see you in the next one. Right, so to make the wig, you're going to start with a clean mannequin head. And I'm using this kind of mesh weaving cap. And I like this brand because the cap is stronger. So after you've installed the mesh cap onto the mannequin, you're going to just secure the cap with pins and you're going to make sure you secure the cap all the way around. This is the hair that I'm using. It's the 3X Long Braid Hair by Superline Collection. It's 100% Canicolon hair. And I really like the texture, so this is just what I'm using, just if anyone is wondering what kind of canicolon hair I used. So this is the hair that I'm using, and this is what it looks like. Before stretching and pulling it, I cut the hair in four. As you can see, I'm using really small sections to add the hair onto the wig cap. So you want to use about micro braid size sections of hair. Grab your latch hook and push it through about two holes. Stick your hair on the latch hook, close the hook, pull through, and then loop the hair through that little hole and secure like this. It's very easy and this way just makes the process go so much faster. All right, so to cover up these spots, you want to start getting even smaller pieces of hair. And you get maybe this small. And start installing until you fill up those places. Alright, so I've closed it as much as I can and I think it looks good enough. So for the hairline, you want to push whichever side you want your hair to fall. You're going to crochet some hair along the band itself. So I'm just going to shift this pin so it's easier for me to crochet the hair on. And make sure you keep your cap secure at all times. Just grab a small section of hair. And put the latch hook through the band. Close. And pull through. And for the band, you're going to have to loop around and pull through one more time to make sure it's really secure.
this is what it looks like. And that's the hairline. All right, so I have finished making my wig and one of the things I'm going to do now is heat treat it. And I'm going to be using a regular blow dryer with a comb attachment. And that's just to distribute the heat evenly. If you don't heat treat this hair, it's going to tangle up and your wig just won't last as long. So I'm going to take it to another room and blow dry it. What I'll just be doing is grabbing sections of hair and combing through it until it's completely treated. The hair is so much easier to brush now. I can just glide my brush through it and I'm going to turn it so you can see the different angles. That's the front. When it starts to get kind of dull, you can put a little bit of oil sheen or natural oil like coconut oil on it just to keep it looking shiny. But after you heat treat it, it shouldn't tangle as much as if you don't heat treat it. I'm ready to try this wig on. So let me try it on so you guys can see what it's going to look like on me. This is what the wig looks like now that I've finished installing it. This is the front and the inside looks like that and that's the back this is it for this video i have finished installing and i am loving the hair so far i did put a little bit too much hair but that's okay i can either take some out later or just leave it the way it is um this is my front part and it looks very nice and neat and you have to remember use the really small pieces to close up the front and this is the back you don't have to do any cutting because once you stretch and pull the hair the hair is pretty much layered the way you would want it and this is the side So if you want the hair to be out of the way, you can definitely put this in a ponytail. All you have to do is get your little hair tie and there. Alright, and this is what it's going to look like. Alright. All right, so this is it for this video you guys i hope you enjoyed and i will come back and show you what else i'll be doing using this hair that superline sent me okay so stay tuned for the next video i will see you please be sure to rate comment and subscribe bye